<laughs> it's the one on ICQ and I'm back, man. Um, I was just thinking about this guy about a month ago. I was like, where is Soul Luminati? So let's get to see your body. Oh, Mama Mia. I don't know. Is that, is that Mama Mia? I don't know. I was trying to do the Tupac. Uh, the Illuminati chest. Whatever. Um, he just simply titled this video to end. I don't know what the hell this means. I see Dewey So is in the building. Now, I was paying attention. I, well, was I, I wasn't watching him, but I, this is one of the niggas I remember before I was even doing YouTube. Paying attention to who's YouTube creators and who's content creators. This is one of the niggas I remember. He was going viral. They'll put his shit on World Star, be on Instagram, whatever, when I first came up. Mm. Excuse me. Um, let's see what the fuck he's talking about. Shout out to him there. All right. It's that shit recording. Dewey So in the building. Yes. <laughs> I told you, Dewey So is in the building. I forgot about the geyser, geyser, geyser. I forgot about it all. He, this nigga never really, this nigga put out a video every three to four months. Like, what the fuck? Man? He's just living life, though. He's so up. He's he's a super OG of this YouTube shit, this one. Sir, geyser. Smooth skin, so in the building. Baby trill in the building, man. Simple. Simple. Am I going to post this this time, bro? Like, am I going to post this? I ain't, I can't do my real intro because I was just doing my motherfucking laundry and shit. I got my boxers on right now. I'm in the house, shit. I'm at home chilling, nigga. So listen, this video is not about me. I've been good, bro. I'm chilling, nigga. Every time you see me, I'm a, you know, it's going to be like I haven't been nowhere because, bro, like, shit, we connected, my nigga. Little do you know, you my little bro. First of all, I'm the big homie. But I don't take that offensive because you're talking to the little niggas. But yeah, where the fuck do this nigga be? Did he? It's like this nigga just went back to regular society, got a regular job, and he just do this when he wants to. Like Maybe he's just eating off all his videos. I don't know, because he has been putting in work for a very long time. Hey, bro, whoever the fuck you is, got to be a real nigga, though. No fem boys. Yeah, 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 yeah. Okay, okay. I spoke to someone, but yeah, yeah, real. I'm, I'm, I fit the real nigga category, not the little bro category. But hey, it don't matter if little bro, big bro. We real nigga. <laughs> Yo, so listen. Something has come to my attention today. Today is the first of the month of August, and what sh what actually triggered this video was a a a a two K um a a some fucking 2K gameplay that they had posted and it pissed me the fuck off. And it put me in the mood to just want to complain. So here I am. A lot of y'all got to understand, sometimes God take me away so I can really find myself away from the ethernet stuff because it's not me. Nothing on here is really me in real life. It's just images that I created on this bitch going crazy with y'all. But in reality, when you take everything away from that particular person who got all the clout, all the followers and was getting all the attention and all the money, that person behind all that, that's who you really want to get a chance to know. Because nine times out of ten, everybody y'all see right now online is just protecting their image. It's a lot of bullshit. Hold on, am I even fucking recording? Okay, I just want to make sure. God damn. Sometimes I might be forgetting y'all today. I'm human. Shit going online. One of the things I'm starting to notice, my nigga, the weirdo Hollywood pedophilia, all the weirdo shit that was going on in Hollywood is starting to transfer over to streamers and YouTubers. It's kind of even fucked up to even say you a motherfucking YouTuber in 2024 or a streamer. Because nonstop, all y'all been doing is getting exposed for being weirdos. Like, it's fucked up. That's tough. Every time I turn around, it's another nigga get- We talking about Mr. Beast. It's talking about Mr. Beast. I hope you say the name, Soul Illuminati, because you, you ain't lying like you. You better say the name. It's probably not the only person you're talking about, but yeah. Getting exposed for being a weirdo? Now listen, I'm going to be honest with you right now. It is a very, very, very tough time. And by the way, I've been gone since October 2023. None of this weirdo shit has nothing to do with me. My energy, everything about me was not on YouTube. All y'all other motherfucking new age niggas can 
Absorb yourself in this. This has nothing to do with me. But let me tell y'all this straight up. I remember I was dropping videos on my spiritual channel. See, a lot of y'all niggas is getting older and shit is starting to click. I ain't going to even say you becoming conscious because you still a bot, but shit starting to click. So a lot of niggas you used to watch is becoming weird to you now. A lot of niggas you donated to, a lot of motherfuckers you was just turning up with, you starting to really question them now. You starting to see through them now. When I dropped a video about, I'm about to use this for a, a quick example real quick. Dewey so in the building, man. I don't know why I got my shit like this, but I actually, it looks swaggy. I ain't gonna lie. Don't steal my shit. So listen, yes, bitch, I made it up. Mines. Hold on, did he make up the do rag tied to the shit, shit, or no? To the side? I don't know. I don't, remember, I don't know who made that up. I know I didn't make it up. So listen, I already hear niggas talking. Like, man, the nigga, I can hear your ass, bitch. Custom framing is per Ah, damn. Preserving what's important to the customer. Gotta pay the bro, though. Hey, you gotta let the content creators get paid. I don't mind the commercials. I'm a little Caesars, because that bitch look busting. Even though I don't eat that swine. You feel me? No pork on my fork. You dig? Oops. On my spiritual channel, I dropped a video about Lil Nas X in the past. And this is when he was twerking on the devil and doing all his little weirdo stuff, right? And I was trying to paint the picture and tell y'all he's planted perfectly to destroy kids. If you go to a Lil Nas X concert, you ain't gonna see nothing but film boys and trainees with thongs twerking and doing all type of weirdo shit, right? But when you go online, he was at that time was doing Roblox concert with kids? Fortnite concerts and shit? But no, no children fuck with him. Now y'all gotta understand what a plant is when they put in position to automatically succeed. The stream's fake, everything is fake. But you looking at them like a god in reality. The nigga was planning literally to change the mind. How many of y'all motherfuckers back in 2018, 2017, you was probably 12, 13, 14, probably 15. You grown as fuck now, and you don't want to have nothing to do with Lil Nas X. But back in the day, you was, you fuck with him. But what I'm trying to tell you is this. These weirdos are being planted, and it's starting to happen in the YouTube and streaming community as well. It's been happening. I remember I've been told y'all. I just ain't saying no names. And this video is not to target anybody. It's just the weirdo energy is starting to come over here now. So now y'all got to get gods back like the Kaiser, Kaiser, who's not afraid to really give you a real fucking opinion. Because most niggas is trying to protect their image, especially if you in the, these groups and all type of shit. Y'all got so much to lose because y'all know when groups crumble, everything just go bad. And a lot of y'all ain't even did shit. It's just y'all mans in them. Let me turn my mic down, bro. Man, it took me five minutes to notice I needed to turn this shit down. But look, that shit's still loud. I ain't been on here, so I ain't gonna touch nothing. Damn, is you back? I just started recording, my baby. All right, so listen. It's my girl. She just got back. But look, a lot of y'all got to understand this. Right now on YouTube, I say this year alone, I don't know how many people has got canceled for the pedophilia shit. I know Dr. Disrespect, and then you got the Chris situation. Oh, he's saying names. I was I, I'm about to say this thing about it. He's talking. He ain't going to say no name. Yeah. So, Illuminati, say their names. Nah. Okay. And my nigga over there was with Mr. Beast. You should have been got rid of that fucking weirdo. Like, bro, y'all got to start drawing the line for people that don't want to be human, bro. Like, it is what it fucking is. Just like when I dropped the video about Cooley Ray or Coy Leroy or whatever. Oh, hold on. No Coy Ray slander will be tolerated. She didn't do no... Did she do some PDF? Hold on. Whatever, the, whatever the, my nigga name is. Like, that's my bro. I told y'all, the little, the little girl... The little nigga had... Uh, false information. That's Benzino's daughter. 
false and false news. You losing me, so now you try, I forgot you was going at her. That's a girl, bro. Have you seen her mom? Like it's a her mother is alive, and we definitely know who her dad is, even if he's a whatever you want to call it, however you want to. You know what I'm talking about? Uh, anatomy. Her whole body looked like mine, and I study anatomy. I study human anatomy so I could tell what is what. And at the time, I was deeply on semen retention. So I had a lot of energy on my no fab shit. I wasn't really on no lustful shit. So when I'm coming across beautiful ass girls, I see a beautiful ass girls. And when I'm coming across a nigga, I see a nigga. And I told y'all straight up in that video, bro, this bitch could be a boy. I told y'all she was an intersex. Speaking of intersexes, look up what just happened in the Olympics. Old girl got hit one time and quit because the trainee punched too hard. What the fuck is trainees doing boxing against women? I'm telling you right now, fem boys, trainees, all y'all niggas catching these hands if you ever come near me. You can be the prettiest trainee of all time. I'm beating you up if you ever put your hands on me. You catching these hands. He's. You catching them. 1HP, I'm going to leave you on 1HP to give you a choice to go back to your normal state. I ain't going to completely get rid of you. I'm going to leave you on 1HP so you can think, oh. So you can remember who the fuck you are. You a man. But listen, back to, like I was saying with Cooley Ray, I told y'all, bro, a lot of people coming around. Oil Ray. Shout out to the skinny girls. The skinny girls is winning. I, the slander is, I don't, I'm not, I, I, niggas that get on, that talk shit about bitches, I ain't really fucking with that. I'm not saying she's a bitch, I'm saying females. I told y'all, by the time 2030 get here, life gonna be so fucking different. Because now y'all got these new species, these new, I call them test tubes, but it's really a lot of deeper shit going on spiritually. But I, this is not my spiritual channel, so I ain't going to talk about that. But you have these new type of beings that's here who don't want to be human. So they would call themselves, they, the, it, um, bitch, all type of shit. They just don't want to be he or her. They want to be everything but that. This consciousness didn't exist until like 2015, 2016. Y'all know this? It's new. It didn't exist. Like, okay, drag queens and trainees probably been a, been a thing. It just wasn't pushed to the straight community. It was its own thing. But now, bro, it's like you got niggas in groups with them boys. Bro, these motherfuckers. Bro, I, like, bro, I ain't trying to get thrown off topic. I'll talk about that in a minute. But is this nigga drunk? I fucks with you, so malu so maluminati, <laughs> so illuminati. I fucks with you. You one of the young niggas. Well, you're not a young nigga no more, but you one of the early niggas on this YouTube. Hold on, what the fuck are you talking about? That's the face. The look right here. The look of the face is just. Stay on topic, my brother. My nigga, these motherfuckers don't want to be humans. They trying to change the way a kid think. And what's the first what's the first thing these motherfuckers do? They send them to talk to kids at school. That's the first thing they do is sending trainees and drag queens to talk to kids at school. A kid can't make a all they want is V-Bucks and Roblox to put they, they don't bro, they the kids. Monica? The kids. Bro, I can't even remember making a real decision about anything when I was a kid. Have you ever looked at a design and said, you know, what were they thinking when they made this? This nigga just ran at this point. I don't know. This, I thought he was going to do this. But you know what? This is not the, uh, the, 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 what's the name channel, like you said. I didn't even realize that. But it's so easy. But you talking about you going to come to a little kid and say, huh, you can cut off your motherfucker. Bro, that's a future school shooter, right? You just destroyed that motherfucker life. Right. I ain't, bro. Your daughter? I want a dad. I want a penis. Bro, that's a... And this is why I told y'all, some of these motherfuckers be test tubes placed by planet parents to raise them as trainees. They don't even be their real kids. But we ain't gonna go there. Okay? We ain't gonna go there. But listen, what I'm trying to tell y'all is this. This energy is spreading throughout your favorite streamers and YouTubers now. They gonna tell you, oh, it's okay. It's all right. That's my bro. That's my best friend. I still support him. And this and that and that and this. None of this shit is normal. It's all demonic.
It's all weird. And it's all simply to keep targeting kids. Nothing has to do with your grown ass. To be honest, they don't give a fuck about us. If you ain't conscious, they definitely don't care about you. Nigga, you can kill 100 people. One conscious nigga is more powerful than you because that one conscious nigga can wake up a million people that's thinking just like me on the same tip. But listen. Pause. This on the same tip is pause as fuck. So let's go to this YouTube shit now. You got streamers and YouTubers arguing about shit. A girl should be able to have a kid at the, or get married. And the other nigga talking about kids should be able to cut their body parts and do this. Like, bro, I'm trying to tell y'all niggas. And y'all think one both sides is actually going against each other when both is fucking weirdo energy, bro. Why are we even focused on little ass children? It's like now, people who did have kid-friendly content, y'all seem weird now because of them. People who used to just chill and probably play regular games that kids gravitate to, now it's like you gotta watch how you gotta watch what you say, you gotta watch what you do. Cause people now are starting to look at us YouTubers and streamers different. That fucking fake gay or humor that Biden Ross used to do, that's you can't do that no more in 2020. He called my nigga Biden Ross. <laughs> I forgot Soul, Soul Illuminati did not like, he don't like uh, Aiden Ross. He called my nigga. And the irony is, Aiden Ross just did a fucking stream with Trump. He called him Biden Ross. Lord have mercy. The oh, fuck? 20 fucking four. Because too much shit is going on. Don't y'all see this? By the way, bro. Listen, just like trainees, if you're a transgender, bro, if I'm a god, I know y'all going through a lot. And I'm going to be honest with you, on my spiritual channel, I have helped a lot of people get through like suicidal shit. And I ain't even trying to be, act like I'm just this special person. I, I knew I've been in a position to where I actually help people from not dying. And a few of them was getting backlash and just going through shit because they was trainees. Now, they go through spiritual shit, too. Some of them regret it. I even told y'all it's groups that goes against the communities because the communities has nothing to do with them. It's just to go to the kids. Most people make these decisions when they older and they regret it. So imagine what's going to happen to the kids that they let them do this shit and then they get older. You know what I'm saying? That ain't going to get pushed. They're going to just talk about, oh, it's okay. But they ain't going to never show the backlash, the, the deaths. All the surgeries, the, the bro, trainees is leading in suicide, all type of shit. It's like crazy, right? But listen, I can give all y'all y'all own planet, give all y'all superpowers and natural resources, y'all own planet. In a hundred years, the whole planet would be wiped clean. All y'all would be dead because y'all can't create nothing. Y'all can't create life. Y'all just take. And it's not all y'all, but if you're a part of that community, that's y'all. I just want to make sure my. You ain't about to die, my bad, yeah. Same with little, whoever my man's talking about with little kids, 12 year old, 13 year olds, should be able to get married and have children and all this, bro. A, a little kid, have a, that she don't have, she's not developed to give nutrients, vitamins to breastfeed a child, the child would die. She don't have, bro, she haven't even developed yet, bro. And these are man made niggas be starting. I agree. He's a little loopy on certain, but. Certain shit he tapped, yeah. I'm gonna talk about history, bro. This this is why I'm spiritual now. I have to remember who the fuck I was and do my own research. Y'all man made shit. Y'all not like us. It don't have nothing to do with me. My ancestors wasn't looking for no little motherfucking kids. They was protected, and we was looking for them juicy ass women who we know we can breed with. And juicy. I'm just at this point. I'm just. I just want. I feel good. The woman was looking for them motherfucking warriors who they know can go out there and make shit happen. Nowadays, bitches is just looking for niggas who at home chilling, jacking off, got a lot of clout. That's it. They just want a clout, nigga. You ain't even. To be honest, now, and I know I'm getting a little bit of off topic. You ain't even gotta really like, bro. This is what I'm saying. Like, it's so easy now, bro. Everything they're all the baddest bitches I know got a price now. You ain't even got to try now. Every bitch got meetups in their bios. It is some. Yo, these bros be having meetups, bro. Meetups to me means. Prostitution. 
especially on Twitter. Excuse me. And I, you know, I love, you no, know, never mind. Good ones out there, my guy, but it's tough out here nowadays. Every bitch a hoe. All she wants is a little bit of attention. That's it. You ain't even got to love her for real. Just make her take a few pics with her and just show you, show people. She feel important now. But listen, back to what I was saying before I end this video, man, a little ass girls, little kids, they not even developed spiritually enough to even take care of their child. The child will die without a parent or without formula or different shit. When a woman have a kid, she naturally need the nutrients or she probably unhealthy or something so she don't have the nutrients. But normally women supposed to have what they need to breastfeed and to feed their children, etc. Uh, younger kids don't have that naturally. Younger kids don't supposed to be doing none of that shit, bro. I can't even believe I'm even having this conversation with. I can't even believe you having this conversation. <laughs> I just was thinking, what happened to so Illuminati with the dreads? What happened to the geyser, nigga? What are you talking about, my brother? I need, look, I fucks with you, so. I fucks with you the, the, the strong way, my nigga. Pause. No dick, no juice, no Adam. We need you to, if, if you, you, hold on, he got a fucking green screen right there. This nigga been making content. He's a green screen right there. He know what he doing. But brother, I feel like this is the same shit you've been pushing, which we know good. Keep pushing because we need this type of shit, but you know what? Shout myself because I'm talking to myself right now. And Thank by you. the way, we all know this, my nigga. That's what I'm saying, my nigga. The other nigga who was talking about cutting eight. <sighs> you talking about Dwayne? What are you talking about? You gotta say it now. If you can, like for real. Oh shit! Hold on. Have to say that he gotta keep playing down the middle so his opinions can feel like something. But bro, whoever this nigga is, I guess he gonna be one of those ones. See, they look for big content creators like that that can keep their shit going. That's crazy. Cause ain't nobody in they right fucking mind gonna let they motherfucking little brother or sister who, or kid in general even look at sex, even talk about it. I'm not having that conversation with a little ass nigga. That little piece of shit, I ain't even talking to him about no fucking sex shit or her about no, that ain't even a combo that would ever exist to a kid. They won't even be around or never see it. So when they be like, I'm having these conversations, and I'm doing this, and I'm, it's up to them if they want to do it. Who's having these talks with kids? Niggas that's already picked out the pedophilia shit in their blood. They not like us. And they said, in their blood. And they had this shoulder, in their blood, face hand. We out, man. Uh, so I, I just got, I just caught a mean case of deja vu. What was the last? So Illuminati video. I think I reacted to one of his last videos. I feel like he did the same shit in the last video. He said a lot of truth. He said some off the wall shit too. Or his own. I didn't say off the wall. I'm saying his own brand of shit. Um, Y'all let me know what your name is. Like, comment, subscribe, notification bell. I'm good.